An abundance of unkept lots and junk outside of homes is prompting Laguna Vista city leaders to take action. Nora Salinas is live in the studio with more on that. Nora. Marcy, unkept weed lots can be a breeding ground for unwanted insects and rodents. That's why the Laguna Vista city manager decided to launch a new program to tackle this problem before it gets worse. Most residents have become accustomed to a clean and quiet community in Laguna Vista, but lately high grass and unsightly property has become a problem. A few days ago I was driving around the community and I was like, wait a minute, oh, all these weedy lots, uh, brush piles. Laguna Vista city manager Rolando Vela says it's unpleasant sites like this that have prompted him to start a new program that will do a clean sweep of the area and make it safer. We don't want we don't want health nuisances. We don't want attractive nuisances. We want people, we don't want opossums, rats, snakes, and cockroaches. And so that's why we're asking people, let's, let's clean up our properties. City officials will drive around the city looking out for possible violations. Anybody that breaks a code will receive a letter or even a citation. Laguna Vista resident Victoria Mock lives in front of an unsightly abandoned lot. She's hoping the program gets it cleaned out. Laguna Vista is a very nice place to live, so I think any extra push to get the rest of the neighborhood looking good We'll work out all right. And it's not just an effort to beautify the town. As hurricane season approaches, Vela says it's imperative to make sure all drainage is free of anything that can cause clogging. There are some brush piles on ditches. God forbid we should get a major rain the next couple of days or the next few days. That's going to obstruct those, that drainage ditch. Uh, so it's about having pride, it's about caring, it's about being responsible. Now, if a homeowner fails to fix a violation, Vela says city officials will go to the property themselves and clean it up. However, the resident will be billed for that service. Live in the studio, Nora Salinas, Action 4 News.